Brandon Overton addressed rumors that he is running a new chassis as well as the fact that he will not be racing in either the World of Outlaws or the Lucas Oil Late Model Dirt Series. Before we get into this, I'd like to ask you, please hit that subscribe button, hit that bell for notifications so you don't miss any of our future videos here at The Trent Report. So just as a refresher reported on this back in December, Paul Clayton, who is a track official uh, at Alltech Raceway and an announcer at SCDRA, he posted this. He says, I heard a lot today regarding Brandon Overton after talking to many different sources, not Brandon himself. It appears that they are getting ready to debut a new chassis and that a national tour is not likely. So half of this rumor is true and half of it is not according to Brandon Overton himself. So fresh off a third place finish at the first race of the Lucas Oil Late Model Dirt Series at Golden Isle Speedway, Brandon Overton talked to Flow Racing, and he was asked about that rumor. And specifically about the chassis, he says that is not true. He says, honestly, people have nothing better to do than sit at home and make up crap or whatever you know what I mean. Or dream up stuff. It's all good. We're still racing and we're going to continue racing. Whatever we do, you know what I mean? Obviously, if we've made a change, we'd tell them. So he says he's still running a Longhorn by Wells chassis. And that is what he is running. So he addressed that rumor. He says it is false. As far as running on a national tour, he actually says that one is true. Uh, when he asked if he was going to run in the Luke Soil Lake Model Dirt Series... He has not submitted a loyalty deposit, and Flow Racing basically says the chances of him doing it are zero because this is what he told them. No, I'm not. Man, we're going to race, and we're going to have fun. I'm going to run so many races. People will think I'm running Lucas as many races we're going to go to. I'll still hit all the big ones anyway. As I said, when we show up, we're going to be ready to go. We're not going to be drained. We're going to be ready to race. So even if he is <clears throat> leading the points at the end of Georgia Florida Speed Weeks, he says he's still does not plan on running the entire Lucas Oil Late Model Dirt Series Tour. And he pointed to last year saying, hell, I was leading the points last year. It can turn around real bad. Nah, we're just going to race and go anywhere we want, anytime we want to and have fun. So that is Brandon Overton addressing those two rumors. Uh, I think when I was covering the initial rumor, a lot of people said in the comments that he would probably be racing a lot of uh, Hunt the Front races so uh, that is possible but it does sound like he is going to be racing still a lot of world of outlaws a lot of luke's oil late model dirt series races maybe the big paying races the big money races and he's going to be chasing those uh but it does sound like he's going to be racing a lot this year though so that should be fun he is one of the top competitors out there obviously failed to get into the top four last year in the luke's oil late model dirt series kind of faded at the end i think he ended up finishing sixth in the overall point standings behind tim mccready and then your top four hudson o'neill Devin Moran, Ricky Thornton Jr., and Jonathan Davenport. So that is what Brandon Overton had to say. Let me know what you guys think uh, of what he has to say here. Uh, are you? What do you make of him not running in the Luke's Oil Late Series or nor the World of Outlaws? Uh, let me know in the comments below.